Filipino farmer is a dying breed. The average age of Filipino farmers is 57 years old. In 10 years, there will be no farmers left. Tinuturing ang Pilipinas bilang isang bansang sagana sa agrikultura. Dahil nagana pa rin ang gutom sa bansa. Natatakot ang Department of Agrarian Reform sa posibleng food shortage kung magpatuloy There's ito. There's no way to earn a living to feed. Bitin kapag walang wala na sa budget. The province is expecting to lose at least half its crop. The problem is obvious. The problem is serious. No more people to farm the land. No more crops to harvest. No more food on the table. Hunger! 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 The problems facing the Philippine agriculture are deep and wide. Any attempt to solve them seems futile at worst and temporary at best. The situation is dire but not helpless. Urgency is of the utmost importance. Actions must be made and it must be done right now. The Philippine ATV Nanotechnology boldly takes the risk in solving this crisis. Nagsimula nga to before personal use of farm namin. Since hindi naman kami naturally born farmer, pero nakita namin ang ganda ng resulta. The aim of the company is threefold educate, share, and inspire. The Philippine Atobi Nanotechnology is originated from the Philippines, so proudly we are. Ang atong technology ay tumutulong para mas maging efficient ang physiological structure ng ating mga alagang hayop or mga pananim through inputs or pakain. And as a result, mas mabilis ang paglaki nila, mas mababa ang pidinti, at malaki ang kabawasan sa mabahong amoy ng dumi ng ating mga alagang hayop. Immediately, pari na rin itong gamitin as organic fertilizer because of the undigested protein which serves as food for the bacteria. Steps must be made. Actions must be done. The Philippine Atopy Nanotechnology is at the forefront of initiating change and invites you to be part of this solution. And more than ever, the time for action is now.